Hello, my name is Crystal Comber and I'm the CEO of SlickTrade.net. In this presentation, I'm going to teach you about risk management and daily trading rituals that I use every day to help me with my trading online. First, I need to start with a disclaimer. When trading with Nadex, IG, Forex, or binary options, as with any financial asset, there is a possibility that you may sustain a partial or total loss of your investment funds when trading. As a result, it is advised that you should never invest with or trade upon money which you cannot afford to lose through this manner of trading. Trading involves a real risk of loss. Please read through our terms and conditions and the rest of the, this disclaimer by pausing the video below. What is risk management? Risk management is an essential part of a trader's daily life. Without following risk management, active online traders risk the potential of losing all profit gained in a simple one or two trades. By following a daily and monthly routine, you will establish secure trading habits and develop yourself into a highly lucrative professional. I have developed a routine that I follow every month and without a doubt am highly successful by following this plan. So let me share it with you. Number one daily trading ritual, your trading journal. By being a member of Slick Trade, you are given access to your own trading journal. I took the time to create this for everyone so that you may all be successful and keep daily, monthly, and yearly reports. Everything is automated to make your life easy, or easier. <laughs> all you need to do is fill out the information. You will find this to be very helpful, especially around the lovely tax season. Use your journal da daily. I cannot stress this enough. And please note, the version given in the members area is for Excel. If you do not have an Excel installed on your computer, then you may download OpenOffice for free at openoffice.org. And we have a new um, download link on there for the OpenOffice version, okay? So let me show you an example of how I use the journal. Testing and tracking. That is going to be your first tab in the lower left-hand corner of your Excel book. This is a section that you may or may not often use. Okay, I use it a lot because I like to test new ideas that I see or different things trending that I see. Okay, This can be uh, used on strategies that you've purchased or ideas that you have when seeing specific patterns occurring on a regular basis. Okay, it's a great way just to, to test and track whether a strategy is, is solid and winning. Okay, and it automatically tracks your winning percentage rate if you just put in your wins and losses. Okay, the next tab is your yearly report. This is an automated section that keeps track of your monthly results as you trade throughout the year. It makes it much easier to have an overall track record to refer to without having to spend the time calculating your yearly results. The next tabs are your monthly reports. They're named October, November, December, you know, each month separately. Okay, Everyone will more than likely use these sections differently. And feel free to change the name of each column to better fit your needs. I personally like to fill out the currency tab, a simple yes or no, if it won or not, and the time under the daily tab. Under the monthly report, I like to enter my account balance at the beginning of each day, the account balance at the end of the day, and the number of wins versus losses. At the bottom, it will automatically calculate your uh, winning percentage rate, okay, and your uh, profit for the month as you go through each day, okay? Number two daily ritual, staying consistent. One very important factor that many online trading newbies do not understand is that staying consistent is one of the absolute most important rituals to be successful. When starting out, we seem to get into this mentality of, I need to make money, make money, make money. 
what you need to rearrange in your thought process is that you will have losses. To be prepared for these losses, you must be consistent. I've said it multiple times now, but trust me, I have been burnt bad for not staying consistent. So I'm going to say it one more time. Stay consistent. What I mean by this is, first of all, make a plan and stick to it. Let me give you an example. Let's say I have $5,000 in my account and the month of March is right around the corner. All right, so I want to get prepared for that. I would first write down a daily goal of, let's say, for example, $500 profit per day. At five trading days per week, you are looking to achieve around $2,500 per week or $10,000 per month. This is a very doable goal, and I will explain this more in depth. But first, you need to decide how much you're going to risk to make this profit weekly, monthly, and what rules you're going to follow. So let's say you decide to risk five contracts per trade, and this is a Nadex uh, platform example okay so let's recap you want to make a profit of five hundred dollars per day two thousand five hundred per week ten thousand per month overall okay your plan for the month of march is to take five contracts per trade at five contracts per trade with a risk of sixty dollars to make forty dollars the profit per winning trade would be two hundred dollars the loss per losing trade would be $300. If you took three winning trades per day, then you would be over your daily goal of 500. But remember, there will be losses. So I need to stress the point that you need to consistently take only five contracts per trade for the entire month. Just because you have a few 100% winning days or maybe 100% winning week or, or, or the entire month, okay? It does not mean this is going to continue to happen. Do not bump up your contract amount simply because you've been winning for a, a period of time or you feel it's going to win. Remember to always look at the long term, not the daily. So let's say that for the first week of March, you took five trades per day, equaling a total of 25 trades for the week. Six of those trades lost and 19 won. That's a 76% win rate, which is quite low, but this would still leave you with 3,800 in wins, 1,800 in losses, with a total of 2,000 profit for the week. Pretty close to the income you were looking for weekly, even with a low win rate. Let's say that the remaining three weeks result in the following. Week two, 20 wins, five losses, 80% win rate. Your profit would equal 2,500. Week three, 22 wins, three losses, 88% win rate. Your profit equaling 3,500. Week four, 19 wins, six losses, equaling a 76% win rate, profit equaling $2,000. Your original goal was to make $500 per day, $2,500 per week, or $10,000 for the month of March. Again, you want to look at and look at the long term, okay? Not just daily. By simply staying consistent, taking the same number of contracts at the same risk, you ended the month of March with 80 wins and 20 losses, a win rate of 80% overall, and a profit of, drum roll please, $10,000. Your original goal was met, even with losses, but by simply staying consistent. Number three daily ritual, emotion. Another key factor when trading is keeping emotion out of your trading. This is not easy. It is something that I still struggle with on a daily basis. Some things I have found to help me daily with my emotions are, do not rush into trading. The market will always be there. Do not think you need to rush into a trade every time you see an opportunity. Know what risk you want 
And if it is not available at that time, then set a working order <coughs> or WO. If it fills, it fills. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Be patient and wait for the next opportunity. Keep good posture. Always remember to keep good posture. While working at home, we sometimes forget this simple task. We sit in bed and bend over, hunching our backs, not letting enough oxygen get into our lungs. Set up a little standing station or sit with good posture while at the computer. Shoulders back, head up. I like to throw in some stretching as well at my little standing station that I created. Meditation. I found that taking the time to meditate can really help me relax, focus, and stick to my daily rituals. So try it out. There's lots of free information on the internet. There's a lot of free apps for your phone. You can just create a meditation uh, channel, radio station on Pandora, which is also free, and just learn to meditate. There's a lot of different forms, sitting, standing, meditation where you move, or laying down, okay? Working out. Get your body moving. You don't have to go to a gym. Have fun in the comfort of your own home. I personally enjoy lifting hand weights, doing sit-ups, push-ups, jumping jacks, and more while, be, while by, at the computer. Have fun while doing it. We like to do Richard Simmons at our home. We call it Simmons and Salads. Do some Richard and follow with a nice shower and salad. And Richard Simmons, you can find him on YouTube for free. It's a lot of fun, you guys, seriously. Eating healthy. Add some fruits and veggies to your diet. Make sure you are not overindulging. I like to say each meal should have three or more colors to it. Drinking water. Keep your body hydrated. This is very important. Okay, 60% or more of our bodies consist of water. Water can boost your energy levels. And when dehydrated, our concentration levels are reduced. Don't stare at the charts all day. They aren't going anywhere. Set your working orders, stop losses, and take profits. Walk away for a bit and do some stretching or fun activity. When you experience a loss, know that you will be just fine if you stick to the plan you have enforced for yourself. You will not win every time, and some days you may be in an overall loss. But again, look at the long term. I can't stress this enough. Give those markets the Chuck Norris kick, all right? Everything is going to be okay. Number four daily ritual, stay focused and stick to your plan. By staying focused daily and sticking to your monthly plan, you see yourself transform into a very profitable trader before you know it. Stay positive and follow your plan to a T. Recap. Risk management is an essential part of a trader's daily life. Without following risk management, active traders online risk the potential of losing all profit gained in a simple one or two trades. By following a daily and monthly routine, you will establish secure trading habits and develop yourself into a highly lucrative professional. Daily Ritual 1. Keep track with your trading journal. Daily Ritual 2. Stay consistent with the plan of attack you create. Daily Ritual 3. Do not let emotion take you over. And Daily Ritual 4. Stay focused and follow your monthly plan to a T. That's it. Now implement these rituals into your daily trading and watch yourself transform into a successful, experienced trader.